क्लिक द बेल आइकन टू गेट लेटेस्ट वीडियोज फ्रॉम इकीडा हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन द प्रीवियस टॉपिक वी हैव डिस्कस्ड अबाउट द कैथोड रेस एज वेल एज द एनोड रेस बेसिकली द नेगेटिवली चार्ज इलेक्ट्रॉन एंड पॉजिटिवली चार्ज प्रोटॉन एंड नाउ इट इज अ टाइम टू टॉक अबाउट द न्यूट्रॉन्स सो व्हाट आर द न्यूट्रॉन्स एंड व्हाट आर द प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ इट लेट अस डिस्कस अबाउट इन दिस टॉपिक So now let's talk about neutron. So neutron was been discovered by Chadwick in a particular experiment where he made a bombardment of the helium with the other particles producing the other product and the neutron. So now let me give an example related to this reaction and let us see that how the neutron was been formed. For example, if we consider beryllium having an atomic number of 4 and atomic mass of 9 and suppose if this beryllium is basically collided or is bombarded with high velocity of helium having an atomic number of 2 and atomic mass number of 4 so the product form here is carbon having an atomic number of 6 and atomic mass of 12 so the other particle is also been produced over here that is nothing but having a mass of 1 and since it doesn't consist of a charge particle so that's the reason here it is zero so this particle was been considered to be known as the neutron so here basically the reaction is nothing but it is basically a transmutation reaction where the beryllium is treated with that is high velocity bombarded helium so as to form a carbon along with that of a small particle and this particle is nothing but a neutron having zero charge on it so this is one of the example and now let us discuss about the properties of the neutron so here are the properties of the neutron so let's start with the first point that is it is slightly heavier than proton and has a mass of 1.674 into 10 raised to minus 24 gram so while comparing the mass of proton and mass of neutron we have got to know that is the mass of proton is nothing but 1.672 into 10 raised to minus 24 but in this case that is we have got to know about the mass of the neutron it was found to be 1.674 into 10 raised to minus 24 gram so that's the reason it is slightly heavier than that of proton talking about the next point that is it does not carry any electric charge hence it is electrically neutral because we have discussed in the previous topics that is the cathode ray consist of the electrons that are negatively charged and talk about the anode rays that are also known as canal rays that is the particle consisting of a positive charge but in this case that is for a neutron which was been discovered by chadwick it is found to be chargeless or it is electrically neutral and talk about the next point we have obviously we understand that is the nucleus of an atom consist of proton as well as the neutron so because of the presence of the neutron and the proton it provides the stability to a particular atom and that's the third point and now let me discuss about the next one that is except hydrogen atom all atoms have neutron in their nucleus along with the protons so consider another example suppose if we consider carbon so carbon is the one that has an atomic number of 6 and atomic mass of 12 so this represents that is it consists of 6 protons and 6 neutron particles in the nucleus of the carbon atom so this is how basically all the other atoms except the hydrogen consist of the neutron present in the nucleus but hydrogen doesn't consist so this all are nothing but the properties of the neutron that is what i want to discuss about and that's it so thank you friends for watching this video i hope you have understood this video very clearly and i hope i'll see you next time till then don't forget to subscribe ekra channel thank you so much